Welcome back to Relax It's Just Wine. I am Tony Del Sol, and I am going to discuss a wine that I found today at my wine shop here in California. I was just looking around to see what I can get for this weekend, and I found this beautiful baby. Textbook, Cabernet Sauvignon 2019 from Napa Valley. I mean, never heard of them. I even asked the wine clerk there, and she had no idea who they were, but she's like, oh, I saw a lot of it. I was like, okay, that's helpful. So I Googled it and got some really good reviews out there. So I was like, you know what, what the hell? I'm gonna try it for, it was around $27, $30. It was like $30 actually. Uh, but I saw it online for $27 at some places. If you buy like six or more bottles and stuff like that. So I'm dying to try this. So I poured a little bit out already. And according to the bottle, it says 13.3. Now I'm suspicious about that because that's pretty cool if they can do that especially in Napa. So, very, very curious about that. Okay, let's taste this. Can't handle it, can't handle it anymore. <clears throat> Damn. Okay. Surprisingly good. Really good, actually. Okay. Okay, that's, uh, can I say okay one more time? That's pretty cool, I, for a wine I never heard of. And that's what I love about finding places like this, little boutique wineries, because they sometimes have the best damn juice out there. Because they make deals with other wine growers out there in Napa, cut them a deal, grab their grapes, and then their winemaker just does what they do, and they come up with something like this. I mean, if you told me this was 50, 60 bucks, I'd probably believe you. Especially because it's got the Napa you know, name on it from California, so. Um, yeah, low tannins for a cab, that's awesome. Wow, love that. This is how I like my cabs. Mm. So if you like that kind of style, low tannins, low acidity, this is one to check out. All right, it's definitely got uh, my favorite blackberries, plums, a little hint of vanilla. Spices for sure. Oh, damn. I'm gonna take one more sip. Oh my god, that chocolate. Dark chocolate, so good. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna recommend this one for sure. And guys, this is one of those wines I always tell you to can. Let's put it right out of the bottle. And I had a feeling it didn't need it. Um, Still, I mean, still the can for at least an hour if you can, maybe 30 minutes. I mean, I have the bottle, it's really good. But the more air it gets, the more it's gonna develop. So the can for about an hour. Um, yeah, this is this is a go-to for sure. Um, I did buy the Merlot too, so stay tuned for that one. So remember to like, subscribe, make your comments, and relax. It's just one. Salud.